Aloha, my name is Dr. Stephanie Han, and today I'd like to talk to you a bit about our belief frameworks and what it is that we believe, why we come to believe it, and how this affects our writing and our life in general. So I come from a fairly traditional Asian American family. Um, the belief system really varied in that my father was a scientist. He was deeply Confucian. His uh, mother was a Buddhist. There was a sister who went to the West and became a Catholic. There were all kinds of religions that existed and coexisted within his family, within his immediate family, brothers and sisters and cousins who had different kinds of philosophical and religious outlooks. And it, it didn't really matter for his particular family. What the family came to see, obviously, was that belief was likely to be extremely private. There was something that they did and to function as a family, to function as part of a community. And then there was something that they personally believed which was intimate to the self. What happens often is that we feel compelled to join a framework, a larger framework, in order that we belong. We want to belong somewhere. We want to connect with people. And this makes perfect sense. But what we have to ask ourselves is what is it that we truly believe and how do we want to connect to people? If we do not believe something and yet seek connection from people who have a particular belief, we will never feel completely right in that setting. We will feel that we are outsiders to this community. We might attempt to bend the framework or to alter the framework as if to fight within the community and have it extend its interpretations of whatever belief this community holds. But this will not make us happy. This will not give us completion because we are not really subscribing to the belief of this particular community. So what then is the alternative? The alternative has to be that we have to come to a kind of sense of belonging about who we are within ourselves. In other words, we have to belong to who we are and to know that we are okay in this world and that we validate our own selves. And if we have this idea, we have the flexibility then to enter into any belief structure and framework and to enjoy and to take and to give what we can within that context without feeling strife because we're okay in and of ourselves. So turn inward if you want to think. Do not seek outward validation from a belief framework. You, you might glean different ideas, but you must turn within and validate yourself before you go and join a community and find yourself at odds with them. I hope this makes sense. Um, the reason I presented this is this can be very relevant to how we write because we have to write with an idea of authority about what it is that we believe in the world when we're constructing characters and world building. Okay, so take care. Um, if you're interested, please subscribe um, to my Substack newsletter on drstephaniehan.com and hope to see you in class. And hit subscribe on this YouTube channel. Cheers. Aloha. Bye-bye.